let's say that we want to find up to our second order Taylor series approximation. Firstly, we begin at n equals 0. Then, we will go back through and simplify after. Then we will move to our higher power terms. Then, from here, you could continue to add terms, hence the definition of Taylor series as an infinite sum. But, we will cut it off here, and we could say that our next term would be of order to the third power. But, we'll talk about that shortly. Simplifying our Taylor series, we get the following equation. Let's plot our actual e to the x function, and then the first and second order Taylor series approximations at a center point of 1. The first order expansion will just be the first two terms here, and this is simply a straight line. Secondly, our second order expansion is an even better approximation as it uses a parabola. As you can see, within a small range around our center point, we have a very good approximation of our function. 